It's been 10 weeks and now it's time to start bringing the Russians up out of hibernation. They went into hibernation on the second day of November. As I'm recording this now, this is the 17th day of January. And I'm going to walk you through exactly what we do to bring them up successfully. First order of business when you pull them up is get a weight. See, we've got a weight of roughly 455 grams here for formally. So it looks like he lost only 10 grams over the hibernation, which is just perfect. The next thing I do is I'll take them and he's cold. He's been in a 45 degree, 45 degree refrigerator here for six weeks. Move him over into a dark pen. I'm going to put him in his put him in this hide. You can see him in the hide there. And that in this pen, I got my overhead light on. And tomorrow morning, when the lights come on at 6 a.m., he will have slowly warmed up overnight. He'll come on out into the sun, and he'll start warming himself. And I'll show you that next. And here, pretty much right on cue, it is a little after 7 a.m., and there he is, out warming himself underneath the heat lamp. The next thing you need to do when you bring your Russians up is you want to make sure, this is, you always want to make sure you have fresh water for them available 24 by 7, but you want to get them into a good soak, and that because the entire hibernation event is stressful, it suppresses their immune system to a degree, and you want to make sure that they can evacuate everything that's basically built up in their bladder as their kidneys continue to process moisture while they're hibernating. So get them into a soak next. We'll show you about that. There, before I could get him in for a soak, he uh, found the water bowl. He's taking a good big drink and that, and he'll evacuate after that. So like I say, make sure that you have fresh water in your Russian tortoise pen at all times because they will drink. Mine drink two to three times a week and they will take a very big drink after coming out of hibernation. <coughs> and after a soak, put out some uh, organic beautiful looking collard greens and to no one's surprise our formerly hibernating tortoise, one of my smaller males, is out and eating because they are going to be seriously hungry. So I put out a tray and usually within I would say five minutes of being soaked many times they evacuate and that they're out eating because they are hungry. So that's the whole hibernation process from the first video to the second one of basically how to bring them up, bring them up slowly to back and eating and you've got a tortoise that's had a two and a half month rest which is superb for their health and what they do in the wild back up and eating and motoring around as they will be. Good luck with hibernating your Russians. Mm -hmm.